Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hi, how are you? Bonjour, buenos dias. Como estas, sister? I'm driving. I broke my um, vehicle phone holder that they on the dashboard, so this is why you see me this way. <laughs> uh, how are you, beautiful sister? Today is 11th of January, 2024. I'm at the traffic light. I'm here near Central Park, my neighborhood. It's been my neighborhood for the past two and a half years now. And uh, Saturday is my birthday. I'm turning 50, five zero. At the next light, at the roundabout, take the third exit. It's 8.19 in the morning, in the AM. You know what AM means, right? Anti-Meridian, yeah. So I'm- At the roundabout, Take the third exit onto Central Park West. I'm going to pick up this beautiful queen, a new friend of mine. She's also a client, meaning I work for her. I drive her to work. I help her. I love being of service. So she asked if I could help her today. So I'm taking her to work, Midtown Manhattan. You know, as a caregiver, companion, working with the amazing company called Papa, it's amazing how you get to meet amazing, awesome people. You learn from them, they learn from you. You have a good time chatting and getting to know each other. I met the wonderful people for the past year and a half working with Papa. So I'm a pal, meaning um, I help either around the house or car rides, transportation to and from the doctor, office, the airport, or just um, running errands with them, grocery shopping, sometimes technical support, they need help with their computer, their cell phone, maybe they are elderly people that don't know how to create an email account, go online, do Google search, be on YouTube, all that awesome stuff with the online world. So I help them. Sometimes they need help cooking, Pet help, some of them have dogs and they need help. So it's different services that Papa provides and it's very, very beneficial for people that are on Medicare. It's through the health insurance. I highly recommend you Google Papa and search. I think they're in all states here in America. So if I move to Connecticut or Pennsylvania or Georgia, I will still stay with them because they're located um, in those states as well. It's early morning and people are already honking, upset, mad, angry, aggravated, frustrated. <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm taking it zen, cool, calm, collected, confident, <laughs> cool. But sometimes it does make me become angry because some of the drivers here are insane they have no patience they're disrespectful they're super negative and they're ready to curse at you or give you the finger i had a man give me the finger once but i think a lot of them also because i have, when i used to wear the hijab they look at you as uh, the enemy the foreigner and they have this prejudice and discriminatory stance on you so as soon as they see you as a muslim they're like already hating you without knowing you, without knowing anything about you, just because what the... In three quarters of a mile, turn right onto West 97th Street. But the mainstream media has been spreading of lies, of misconceptions about Islam and Muslims in general. phone call from Papa. They're probably asking me, where am I? Where am I? Or maybe they want me to help another member. All right, I'm going to stop the video so I can give them a call and find out why they just called me. So remember, my beautiful sister, have a wonderful day. Keep counting your blessings every single day. This too shall pass whatever of hardships you are going through. Trials, tribulations, struggles, they come and go. 
one day you're doing great next day you're struggling the following day you're back at it again. speed limit camera ahead it's a vicious circle vicious circle round and round and round it goes all right stay blessed stay inspired stay educated and remember be unbreakable bye